Stay in the ice bath. Oh. Ice bath. gym in Newcastle, it's just opened I think yesterday, um, very very sick gym, probably one of the best commercial gyms I've seen, um, from the kit perspective, the way the gym flows, like we're just about to hit a high rock simulation, you couldn't do it in any other gym, so that's pretty sick, change rooms, we've got ice baths, saunas in and whatnot, um, so yeah, it's pretty cool, um, so I'm here now with Marcus Brandon and Brendan, that's right, Marcus Brandon and Brendan, uh, we're going to hit a high rocks full simulation. Um, we have, we are eight days out from the London event. Um, and yeah, we're going to test the waters in our pairs now and see how we fare. Be tasty. Come at the end of a very brutal training week, so body sore. Need a good warm up, and then we'll sink our teeth and see how we get on.
We've clocked off a high rock simulation earlier today and then me and the man behind the camera Lou have headed all the way to Manchester quick two and a half hour drive and we're about to go and watch Chris Williamson of Modern Wisdom podcast which I'm sure most of you are aware of um, we're at the Northern Royal Museum of Art College of Art College of Music College of Music um, in Manchester um, Really looking forward to it. The event is, he's doing a tour basically in the UK and it's tonight's event on self-discovery. So, very interested, very grateful for Lewis for inviting me. Um, yeah, looking forward to seeing what he has to say. Always, always ready to learn. So that's a wrap on the Chris Will Show. We're just on our way back up north now. Um, it's going to be a late night. I'm due to get back about 12 o'clock and then we'll be up at 6 for a big Super Saturday with the boys and then we've got a massive day tomorrow at HQ with Studio 6 as well. We've got Games Day. Um, but yeah, just to kind of recap on, on this evening, um, it went really fast, which uh, obviously means it was good. Um, Chris is like, it's amazing to see how far he's come. Um, we actually had him live at the training club. I think it was. I feel like it was in there. It was in the first year that we were open. I think wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So it was like two and a half, three years ago. Which is mad to think that he was actually sat in front of us. Um, but yeah, one of the most profound things he said tonight for me was um, that I've just recited on there with Lou was the fact that you're always looking for the next destination, the next goal, because you think that that's going to bring you happiness. No doubt people have heard this before, but um, 
I think I'm the biggest sucker for that in regards to constantly I don't know if it is me looking for happiness with, within that but it's just constantly like to the next goal right what's next to the next goal and you're just kicking the can down the road constantly um, and you just reiterated how important it is to find happiness in, in the present and where you are now and kind of um, yeah in the day to day of, of what you're doing and look for more joy and don't be too serious with everything because a lot of us are nose to the ground fucking smashing away trying to achieve goals and stuff but if you can't enjoy it then what's the point um, so yeah it was quite cool to hear him say that live and it landed quite well with me uh, so yeah I just thought I'd share that one with you no doubt a few of you are of, of the same mindset so yeah about 90 minutes out now <clears throat> see if I can keep my eyes open let's go So it's the morning of games day, late night last night, very little sleep. Got in, got an early session. Um, I'm speaking quiet because the team are just going through a little run through now of what to expect, a little coach's brief. Um, it's going to be a sick day, I can't wait for this one. Come check it out. Get flowed into the pond anyway for the uh, bench. I want you to use this as like your uh, standard. So if someone's like. Last time we did this, it's 20 minutes to find both. So it's up to them when they change over. It's not 10 and 10. If they find the back spot in eight minutes, they've then got 12 minutes for the bench. And just there was a little bit of confusion last time we did it. It doesn't have to be perfectly split. Just find your back spot, find the bench. Yeah, because I have to wait for the whole team. Bye, 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 Has everyone got their teams written down on their hands? Yep, just some nod of heads. Brilliant. Yeah, all I will say, guys, is it is very much team day, very much community. Let's just have the best day ever. Really enjoy every single event. Everyone's going to be in the same boat, so don't think that you're dying and somebody else isn't. Everyone is going to be in the same boat, but let's just kick off and have the best day ever. Is, but... ah! 
members have absolutely smashed it like I said they get bigger and better every single time we do it um, I hope you've enjoyed this video uh, it's a good insight behind the scenes to what these games are all about um, and you won't know this but it's a little bit of a sad time for us today because uh, Colo the young man Colo is going to be leaving us it's his last day today um, he's going to be well he's got the what is it you're going to be doing you're going to go to college foundational year of college and then I've got three years Three years of uni, and then <laughs> off to Australia. That's the plan anyway, isn't it, bro? Yeah? Fun boy. Like I say, that's a wrap. Give us a follow. Let me know how you found this video in the, com in the comments below. And I'll see you at the next one.